What's up, what's up, what's up, what's up there guys? This is Gibalin Football Channel, Kaza Cheese Football Channel Football from the fans perspective Welcome back, welcome to our new video Today we're just gonna do a simple thing But before I do that, I just want to encourage you I have a mask, I have a Kaza Cheese mask Obviously because I'm a Kaza Cheese fan I wanted to make that statement But also, there's a new wave of coronavirus There's, there's new cases now that are being reported And those cases and the rate is just, it's just crazy It's just crazy so i just want to pass this message please please let us live our safe life let us be safe let us wear our masks let us practice social distancing let us keep it clean let us keep it clean let us sanitize let us keep it clean because there's a new wave right now and it's december we're going to december and there's a lot of people traveling from you know different provinces we're going to meet families we're going to meet new people we're going to meet people that are from different places and some of those places there's you know coronavirus cases there so it's very much important very much important please let us keep it safe let us keep it safe you don't want to isolate on december my friend you don't want to be on isolation with december and like 15 16 days of isolation and all that you don't want that thing if you don't want that thing keep it safe no exchange of beer of 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 of, of drinks and all that just have your own thing have your own thing if you are drinking together, have your own thing, have your own class. Because avoid the exchange of, of fluids. Just avoid the exchange of fluids. Avoid the exchange of fluids in any way. Yes, I've said that. Okay, going forward, we're just doing a simple thing. Kaza Chiefs played Pamenda. Pamenda from, you know, Etho uh, from Cameroon. Boys had to travel here for like 16 hours to Ethiopia. Then Ethiopia, they had to travel to Cameroon more hours and to use a bus and all that and then they couldn't train on friday and then they trained on saturday and then they played on sunday and won one nil game that was not interesting the game was not interesting so i'm doing a reaction of that game obviously the game was not interesting but there were interesting things there were interesting things in that game that i think they are worth noting first is the lineup kune was there the defense is still there. The defense is still there. The only changes were on Akumu. I think Akumu was added because, you know, it's from those kind of regions. Those regions and you can, you know, in terms of playing in that football and all that. Some sort of having someone who's familiar with the environment. I think that's, that's, that, that's the, 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 you know, the reason why he was included. Park was included, I think, because of, you know, sort of uh, experience. Experience. You need some sort of stability when you go, you go away. When you go away... Need some a, a, a bit of stability. Otherwise, Blom also started instead of Novo. Yes, I agree that Novo should have played, and I, I I understand why Novo didn't play in that game because it's an away game, and and you you want to avoid injuries. You know, it's it's, it's, it's not you know playing in Africa. It's, those games are not are, are never. They are not smooth. They are not smooth. So it's fine to save some players. But another thing that is worth noting the inclusion of of of, of Nchangas. I've been crying that why Nchangas are not playing. With players here that are not performing well, and Changas has been on the bench for a very long time and was included. It's good for game time, good for the starters, good to build up. Because we need him. We're going to need this guy. I don't want to lie. We're going to need Changas. Nobo is there playing as well, but we're going to need Changas as well. And I'm happy that he was in the lineup. And you know, he didn't have a bad game. Didn't have a game that is lower than the, the, the you know the, the, the performance of the team. No. It was just at par with the team. The entire team obviously didn't do well. But the most important thing, we came with three points. Three points, very much important. Three points away in Cameroon. So far in Cameroon, three points are very much important. Very much important win. Yes, the team that we played against has not been playing professional football because they have not started. They are, I mean, they are, they, they are, their league has not started. The competitions have not started. But it's a team that is it's, it's, it's not... It's just a weak team. It's not just a weak team. They were crowned champions because of COVID-19, but they were on top by like, the time they were crowned champions. So it's not a weak team. It's not a, a team that we found we find, you know, I I I took a strategy. It's a team that has been there. So that's the first thing. That's that's the most important thing. I'm very much happy with the points. Very much with, happy with the win. I'm happy with uh, two players, specifically Kun and Mato. I've been complaining that the senior players are not are not doing us justice, man. These guys have been there. They're not giving us a hundred. They're not performing. But this time around, Kune gave us, you know, a save. A penalty save. Number one keeper. Number one keeper, Kune. We hope and I hope that this whole conversation with, with uh, Akpe and all that, it's, it's going to end. We don't want to have this. 
whole thing of Kune and Agpe exchanging. Kune is our number one. Kune is the number one, and I hope this whole debate, this whole confusion with the coach is cleared. Kune is our number one, very good save. Penalty, 90 minutes. It's very good. It's very much important for us. Mato was caught on the 84th minute. Had the red card, obviously. And I said, even when he got a red card, I said, he got a red card. Part of the reasons why he got a red card at home was because he was fighting for us. And then he scored right now. He scored today. Very much important. I appreciate that we want senior players to be performing. And Mato and Kuni, they gave us 100. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you, Kevin Hunt, for the three points as well. We need to be happy. We have reasons to be happy. Yes, I'm not saying let us, I'm not saying we must be carried away, get carried away, no. But we have reasons to be happy. Another thing, the reason we need to be happy is the clean sheet. We have been leaking goals. We have been leaking goals like nobody's business. And there's not been nice. To me, I, I don't like a team that concedes a lot. I don't like a team that attacks and forgets defense. My interest in the game, more especially, my interest in the game is the defensive side of the game. So, clean sheet to me, very much important. Thank you very much, the defense and the whole team for keeping, keeping a clean sheet. It's a very much important one. I hope we can transfer this kind of mentality, this kind of performance. Not in terms of, obviously the team didn't play so well. But the kind of performance in terms of keeping a clean sheet, winning. Keep a clean sheet and win. The next game we're going to play against Leopards, obviously. Not a dangerous team. Not a dangerous team. So I don't expect us to struggle a lot. Leopards is not so much. But we need a clean sheet. And we need a hundred from the guys. Other than that, I'm very much happy. I'm very much happy in Changasi played. I'm very much happy we won. We are not so tall, People must know the storm is going to is going to pass. The storm will pass. People that are laughing, that are thinking, yeah, it's time to give up. It's time for this and this. The storm will pass. The storm will pass. And 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 Gavin Hunt is not a boy. It's not a small boy. Gavin Hunt is not a small boy. You must check his, his track record. Right now, he's the most decorated coach in South Africa right now. Pito is out there in, in, in Egypt. Right now in the league, is the most decorated coach. And do we have no reason to doubt the most decorated coach? No, man. No. So I'm very happy with the boys. I'm very happy with the coach. I hope we're going to continue going forward. And I hope I hope that we're going to see other players coming back. Nukovic coming back. Zuma coming back. Other than that, I'm very much happy. Thank you very much. Love and peace. <laughs>